Our next big story in depth coverage on the battle between the city of Providence and its firefighters union and WPRI.com reporter Dan McGowan joins us right now. Dan, you were supposed to be there today for a meeting. Um, all sides seemingly agreed to that. What happened? You weren't allowed in. That's exactly right. Now, normally arbitration hearings are typically held behind closed doors. They're not, uh, they're, you know, reporters aren't often allowed to, to attend. I talked to all sides yesterday, the lawyers for the city of Providence, the firefighters union, and then in fact, I got in touch with the arbitrator in the case, a guy named Lawrence Holden, and all sides agreed. No problem if, if, the, if the lawyers say you can come, no problem you can come in. I got there today, set up, was ready for an all day hearing on, on this matter and uh, the arbitrator then informed me that you know he'd kind of thought better of it and decided that I was no, no longer allowed in and presumably that would have been great information to have to to, to be able to be there to report on what was happening at that meeting. Um, how, how do we think this is all going to be playing out here? Is this going to be pretty similar to what we've seen so far? You know I think they'll, they'll definitely still be that sort of lots of public interest and lots of kind of back and forth barbs thrown at each other from both sides between the firefighters and the city but you know think of this kind of it's not quite like a court hearing necessarily but but it, it sort of functions similarly in that both sides will make their case, the arbitrator will listen to it. The difference is that the arbitrator will will eventually make a decision and, and it will be about obviously how much to pay the firefighters, but he may give the parties a, a chance to kind of come to an agreement again. You know, they've been fighting about this for months and months and months, but he may say, here, I'm going to decide something. Why don't you guys reach a deal before I have to do it myself? Warn them almost. That's you know, exactly, exactly right. how it's going to yeah. be playing out. So eventually we should expect an appeal though, no matter what happens. Yeah, I'd be very surprised. I mean, the only chance of, of no appeal would be if the if the uh, arbitrator rules maybe something that the city has already offered but even in that case the firefighters could then appeal so I, I would expect a, an appeal to Superior Court eventually to Supreme Court this is a long process going to play out potentially over a year from now we know you're tuned into us so we appreciate your coverage Dan thank you very much and our coverage does continue online on our website WPRI.com you can read Dan's latest report plus everything you need to know about the Providence firefighter battle